careful. That bag was a gift from the governor of Virginia. I don't know how you do this in Virginia, but here, we prefer to come on announced. Excuse me. You Mr. Ward Allen? Have we met? Let's just say uh, I've met your reputation. Lies, substantially. <laughs> oh, so you aren't the best guy down the river, then? Miss Stubbs here hired our services. <laughs> You're a rare man, Ward Allen, but I'm not a patient woman. Teach me to shoot. What? Is it loaded? Careful now. <laughs> I've made my decision, Father. You've ruined so many prospects. Nothing but boys. See, I feared he'd bring embarrassment, boasting, as it were, over his intentions toward your daughter. Now, you knew it was against the law to shoot some of up. If there's a law I truly broke, I have not read it. Uh, maybe a bit too good of a shot. Are you saying you were born to hunt? Or saying you were born to break the law? You've nothing left to prove with guns and bluster wolf. Try a different weapon. I see you, Ward Allen. I see what you're capable of, and I see how far you've missed the mark. You question my marksmanship? I question your choices, especially the ones that'll send you to an early grave. A smaller man could never hold your interest. If we have grown as a species, it has been because of the test of wildness. It seems that perhaps our world met a fork in the road. And the world took one path. I took the other.